Hello friends, welcome back to Civil Depth BD. Today I will show you how we can solve line load transfer error in ETFs. At first, we have to understand why this warning governs in ETFs. If we model any line where there is no support of any joint or slab and it is carrying any load, in that case, ETFs will tell us that this load cannot be transferred suppose if we select this line and right click of mouse if we go to the loads here you can see that we have a partition wall load which is 7.24 kN per meter but this line is in a empty space right so if we go to analyze and go to check model select all click on ok Okay, here you can see that line load L60 at first not is transferred. That means it can it, it is telling us that loads are not being transferred. Okay. So what we have to do? We have to select the line. At first we have to find out the line. Right, right. Here at first we will go to object assignment, then frame assignment under frame, level. Okay. Go to level, apply. For better understanding, I will go to again and analyze check model. Okay. At first, you have to find out the line actually. Okay. Here it is telling us L, maybe L. Okay. I will copy them. Okay, L60, 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 L60. Okay. Here, if we go to it, it's this one. Then, this one. Here, it is selecting all stories. So, now we can delete this one. That means, after finding out the level of your frame, then you have to just delete the frame. Right. Now, if you go to analyze, then check model. Okay, there is no warning. So, by this way, you, you can solve out the line load transfer error in ETAPS. That's all for today. See you in the next tutorial. Thank you.